European Sustainable Development Network is a really nice place to have peer learning and exchange, to meet people, to do networking, and really to learn about the, the challenges and uh, the things which are working well uh, in other countries of Europe, with policymakers, with representatives from the civil society, from academia, and from business. So this is a great opportunity for me to learn, to exchange, and to do better policies in my own country. The peer learning and exchange is happening uh, in various formats. We have an annual conference, we have different workshops, we have a peer learning and visit in different European countries. So basically we meet, we gather for uh, meetings, whole day meetings, half day meetings, and we discuss about things which are working or which are not working. So uh, this is basically how it's working. And then we also have the, all the networking part, which is quite important. So many things are learned also, not at formal sessions, but with the informal exchange with uh, other members of European countries. The uh, ESDN provides many kinds of different information as a knowledge hub. We, for instance, have a, a website with uh, country sections where we have uh, a lot of information about what all European countries are doing in the implementation of the 2030 Agenda, uh, the Sustainable Development Goals or Sustainability pol uh, Policies, very generally speaking. So this is um, a very interesting um, place where you can find a lot of useful information. We also do have have a newsletter which comes out a few times a year and there we have the updates on what's going on in the different countries but also in civil society and on this on the subnational level regional level local level so this is very useful for us uh, policymakers and other stakeholders The members of the ESDNs are basically national policymakers, uh, policymakers on the national level uh, in Europe, but also from the subnational level. And we have associate members from civil society, from academia, from the business sector, and uh, other people as well. So basically, uh, we would like to continue uh, a, bit, a little bit in the same way uh, than the European Sustainable Development Network used to, to go uh, over the last few years. So we would like to continue to position the ESDN as a, a network for peer learning, for exchange between policymakers and in the exchange with people from, from civil society, from academia and from the business world. So basically, the format should not change too much. We would maybe like to focus a little bit more on specific fields where the um, challenges are the biggest uh, for European countries. Mm -hmm.